Welcome to Cyber CEO, wherein we talk about how our cyber backers helped our cyber CEOs take their businesses to the next level. Cyber CEO is powered by Cyberbacker, the world's leading provider of admin support services from anywhere in the world to anyone in the world. Please visit our website www.cyberbacker.com for more details. Another great day here at Cyberbacker. We're back with another episode of Cyber CEO, and we have a very, very special guest on the show right now. Kyle, how are you doing today? I'm doing fantastic, Jello. How are you doing today? I'm doing wonderful. Thank you very much Good. for asking, and of course for being on the show. We really, really appreciate your time. So, oh, my um, pleasure. For the benefit of everyone who's listening, of course, can you tell us something about yourself, Kyle? Well, my, my name is Kyle Harrison. I, I've been in real estate for a little over 15 years now. I've been a full-time MAPS coach for Keller Williams for a little over three. I have just about 5,000 uh, coaching calls, actually a little over 5,000 coaching calls. Um, full-time investor with a little over 300 doors. Uh, and then I'm also the president and co-founder of a bookkeeping company called Your Bookkeeping Partner uh, LLC. And we're real estate specific uh, and we do the MREA chart of accounts and the MRE model. So we're very Keller Williams specific with our bookkeeping company and have two daughters that are 16 and 14. Um, they are, they're the, uh, my life and uh, just very blessed to, to be able to, to call that, be able for them to be able to call me dad. So it's, it's, it's a <laughs> truly an honor. So that's a little bit about me. Of course, of course. Now, um, for the benefit of everyone who's listening, they might not know what a MAPS coach is. So my qu okay. next question is, can you tell us something? Let's say, what does a MAPS coach do in a regular day? Let's say today or a regular work day. Yeah, no, I appreciate you. That, that's a great question. MAPS coach, MAPS stands for Mega Achievement Productivity Systems. And MAPS Coaching is the largest coaching company for Keller Williams, which is Keller Williams' largest real estate company mm -hmm. uh, as well. And so if you think of it as a coach, we help people get to where they want to go, their dreams, their goals, and days rather than decades. So we push the envelope of their thinking, we change their mindset, or at least help change their mindset, and really get them focused on where they're going and, and uh, create a, a balanced life. Because it's business and real estate uh, it's a great opportunity to make a lot of money. It's, it's a great opportunity to retire. However, it can really grab us. And so it's really that balance of life uh, and then business. And so of we course. coach people through uh, that process. So this must mean that you'll talk to a lot of very growth oriented people every day. Am I right? Oh, 1000%. Yes. Wow. How is yeah, that absolutely. every day? Talking to very goal oriented people every day. Well, first off, it's an absolute pleasure and an honor to be a part of their life. The, the fact that they they invite us into their world, it, it truly is a is a humbling honor to be a part of that. Uh, one of the things you, you are as good as the people you hang around with, right? And so, one thing that's amazing about coaching is uh, it, it's allowed me, you know, have, I had success and I still do have success in the real estate world. Coaching is more about going from success to significant. And then significant to fulfillment, right? We all want to live a fulfilled life. And so being significant in others uh, is pretty remarkable. Uh, people who hire a coach want to get better. They want to do better. So as a coach, I've got to always stay, and, and my colleagues as well, we got to always stay in front of them, mm -hmm. right? We got to always be reading and figuring out what's going on and study the market of where it's going and really listening to them where they want to be and where are they currently and really challenge some of their thinking to get where they want to go. Uh, so it's it's pretty remarkable industry that I'm just super blessed to be a part of um, as a coach. Wow, that's amazing. That's amazing. Now, I know you have, for a fact that you do have your own cyber backer, correct? Uh, I just hired my third one. Wow. Yep. Three cyber backers. So how does cyber backer fit into that day or in the role of being a MAPS coach? Uh, first off, it, Craig Goodliff, the, the founder of Cyberbacker, changed my life about three years ago. Uh, he was actually my red, what we call a red shirt, where mm -hmm. he he onboards me as a, as a coach. And he was it's very hard. It's a lot of accountability and a lot of studying and they want to hire the best. Right. Um, and so he introduced Cyberbacker 
And I had a couple of colleagues around me start using Cyberbacker and how they were using them and what does that look like? And I was starting to do my own, um, getting my own full schedule. So I hired my first Cyberbacker and she worked out for about six months, eight months, and it just wasn't what I expected. Um, and so I talked to Cyberbacker and said, hey, you know, this person's just not doing what I'm looking for, making some mistakes. And then Cyberbacker turned right around, found me a, a, another Cyberbacker mm-hmm. uh, who's happy. And happy's been with me two and a half years. Um, she actually has been so great. Uh, she got a promotion into a, a different opportunity within my organization and with my company. And wow. so happy helped me hire my replacement, which is now Gab. Um, and Gab has been phenomenal um, in that just uh, just really taking everything, honestly, Jello off my plate. Mm -hmm. She does the, she takes all the notes. She handles my schedule. She gets everything to the clients. When I say we're going to do something, she makes sure we do it. Uh, She keeps reminding me stuff that I need to do, keep things, bringing things in front of me. So she really runs me, which is amazing. (laughs) So then I can be 100% engaged with our clients and really coach with them. I can be with them because I'm not worrying about the back end of all the stuff, taking notes, and and that's where I have my cyberbacker. The third, the third cyberbacker mm-hmm. I just literally hired last week. Uh, she's going to be a bookkeeper for our bookkeeping company, and so we're starting to onboard her and train her. And our goal here in the next year and a half to, to two years mm-hmm. is to have uh, somewhere between twenty to twenty-five new cyberbackers wow. that are help building our bookkeeping company. Um, for that. So it's it, Cyberback is an amazing company. It's a great opportunity. Uh, I love where Craig's heart mm-hmm. is in helping uh, with profit share within the Cyberback yes. organization. It's just an amazing opportunity for, um, for people in the Philippines, right? I mean, yes. it's just, it's just an awesome opportunity. And what's fascinating that I've always, I've always admired Craig on is not only just his heart of giving and creating a better life for others is it's hard to be a cyberbacker. And what I mean by that is the, the, the expectation and the level of talent is so high that when someone comes into my world and I'm interviewing them, they're kind of the top of the top. You guys have already done all the background checks, all the, 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 the just making sure that they're great. And that's what, that's one thing that's really impressed me about your guys' hiring. Yes, definitely, because that's our bread and butter here, matching, of course, mm-hmm. our cyber CEOs with our cyber backers, not always just because of the, how they do, I mean, the qualifications, but, of course, values is very, right. very important here in Cyberbacker. That has to match. Now, I know you just hired your third Cyberbacker. You have your own Cyberbacker team over there, but my question is, what makes this a successful partnership with Cyberbacker? The expectations. Yeah, Cyberbacker, you know, it's really about clients first, service first, setting expectations, really understanding what me as your client wants and is looking for. Now, I'll give you a prime example. When we were hiring the bookkeeper, I said, hey, this is not just a, a general kind of bookkeeping or excuse me, a general type of job description. We're looking for very specific qualifications. So we, we talked, we sent out, none of the, the applicants work. You guys got me on the phone again and say, hey, let's let's really make sure, let's work through this. We, we got on the phone again, and then we found uh, two really, really good uh, people to interview, and we hired one. So I think just understanding the client and really listening to what our needs are and getting clarity around specifics that we're looking for is, is really what makes the Cyberbacker uh, partnership for me work. It's not just like, hey, let's go place someone. Yes. You're really listening to place the right one with me. And that's what I love about you guys. Of course, definitely. That's the goal of our, of course, career department. Getting the partnership right always the first time, almost all the time. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Now, one question. Um, you already mentioned a few things that your cyber is currently doing for your business. Can, but can you tell us more? What other things do your cyber baggers do for you in your business? <laughs> the, the real question is, what don't they do? <laughs> Um, aside from almost paying my bills, they, uh, they pretty much do everything for me, um, from, from scheduling to setting up, uh, zooms to, 
to taking all my notes, uh, organizing everything. Uh, so when I hop on in the morning and I, I go to work uh, coaching, they have everything dialed in for me. So it's just a matter. We, we do all Google Sheets, very, very organized. Uh, everything matches to the client, to what Google Sheets, so I can get to it very quickly. Um, they take all my notes, the commitments, mm-hmm. what I say I will do. We put in open items uh, in. Um, they pretty much start. The, the, the thing that's fascinating is, is in the Philippines, is you're 15 hours ahead uh, yes. from, from the U.S., right? So you, they're working before I even get to work, right? So it, it, it's a lot of the, the cyber backers that, you know, Gab and Happy, they're already preparing for the day because you, you're so far ahead on, on time-wise. So when I show up, things are ready. Now, I'll be honest with you, it's the expectations and the partnership and the synergy that I have with Gab and, and Happy and constantly giving them feedback. Hey, maybe think of it differently this way. This is kind of what I'm looking for. Very, They're very open and very coachable, and they ask a lot of questions. And that's that's a that's an environment that I've created where hey we fail forward and we fail forward fast and we also learn from our mistakes. Uh, how can we improve to get better? Gab and Happy bring ideas back to me and say, hey, what do we? What if we did it this way? I'm like, this is awesome, fantastic. So it's that synergy that is really important and just the, the level of communication um, that that I have with my cyber backers. I think that is key in this type of relationship, constant communication. And also, as you mentioned, Absolutely. I love what you mentioned there, failing forward. Of course, we might not mm-hmm. be able to avoid a few mistakes, but the important thing is, again, we fail forward, right? That's correct. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. The, the, only, the best way to learn is through failure. Yes. And it, it, it would be great if we got it all, all right all the time. Um, however, that's not where the biggest learning process is. It's, it's where we're we're pushing the envelope of being uncomfortable and trying new things and and failing forward. Failing forward. Now, one last question for you, Kyle. Um, there are a lot of business owners right now that haven't bought the idea of having their own cyber backer or that virtual leverage. Now, what advice would you be able to give them? Well, great question. Um, First off, just really understand the relationship. I think a lot of business owners, they hire out of, of, of need. They don't hire out of future. So for example, I'm hiring for the future. So like Gab is not just my assistant to do things for me as coaching. I've already thought of the second and third job that she's going to go to. So I really hired for her growth based off of my need today and where she's going to, we're looking at six to eight months to move her into a promotional piece because she's actually got a finance background. So even though she's taking notes and learning the job and learning the coaching of what we're doing today, I've really hired her for the, her future opportunity. So I think that's the one thing is we, we, we business owners tend to hire to the now we need to hire to the future. And, and where do we see that this person can go and how could they start to fill the seats of our future growth? So that, that would be number one. Number two, it is not a like a George Foreman grill. Set it and forget it. You just absolutely do not do that. They're your partner, right? So you got to really take that as a serious and, and, and partnership is really, really important. A coach of mine, a mentor said one time, 90% of the training is done when you have the right hire. So it's still 10%. Well, 10% of eight hours is still 48 minutes a day, right? So even though you're hiring the right person, you still have to pour into them. You still have to have questions and meet with them and set expectations. And they're your partner. They're helping you get where you want to go. And I think some business owners just say, oh, that's what they just need to do. And I'm going to go do this. They'll figure it out. No, absolutely not. So it's really... they're looking to hire virtual is a 1000% an opportunity uh, of looking at not just the cost. It's there's just, there's a lot of things that go along with it. And I'll just be honest with you, like for, mm-hmm. for like Gab and happy and I, we just sit on a, a, a Google chat. That's how we communicate. It's through my phone. It's through computers. So if, if I'm needing something, I'll just sit on the Google chat and it just goes right to her. She pulls it, sends me the link and, and it's away. So it's that constant opening of dialogue at all times. And I think that's the one thing that business owners miss is that continue to keep pouring into the person that they hire and really look at it as a, as a partnership you know, for that. So that would be my, my advice moving that's, forward. 
this terrific advice. First one is again, um, again, trying to build on the relationship every time, right? Mm -hmm. Always, always, always. Now, Kyle, I know that Happy and Gap would be listening, of course, once we have this online. Would you mm -hmm. want them to give a, want to give them a quick shout out on the show? Well, they're first off the, the the fact that they're in my world. It's an honor to be a part of their life. Uh, they they make my world so much easier, so much better. Um, they're just amazing people. I love their servant heart. Uh, they really care. And that's the, that's the biggest thing. They work hard. They're loyal. They really care. They're kind. They're always looking to improve. And it's, it, it's a cause me to raise my level of my game for them. So it's really, it's really an awesome partnership and super, super honored to be a part of their life. And I'm just grateful that Craig created a company Cyberbacker, to give us this, uh, this value. I mean, it's just been amazing. That's actually Craig with the unbelievable leadership here in Cyberbacker as well. And again, talking about your partners in business, people that would really push you to be better than what you were mm -hmm. yesterday, right? No question. Yes. Absolutely. So Kyle, thank you very much for being on the show. We really, My really pleasure. appreciate your time. Thank you for listening to our daily dose of Cyber CEO. Stay tuned to know more about how Cyberbacker creates a difference in this digital time and age. You can visit our website www.cyberbacker.com and follow our social media pages on Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, YouTube, and Spotify.